Hi and welcome to today's tutorial on doing procedural edge masks inside of Mari 2. I've got a little gun model here. Uh, it's a gamer's model which will play a role later. And I'm just going to try and isolate some of the different edges there. We've got edges facing multiple directions so it's going to be pretty hard on this model but uh, let's try. I'll start with a great quick channel and go to the procedural tab and add a geometry surface normal. Uh, Mari 2 ships by default with this surface normal here, just like this. And it's not bad, but um, it has a few problems. It doesn't allow me any control over the normal. And especially on this side, there's a lot of black, and that black might be covering up edges I want to pick out. So I'm, I'm not too happy with this. So instead I'm going to use a custom procedural node, the custom surface normal, which you can get at mari.ideascale.com. Uh, just down here in the user layer node section, you can download it. All the installation instructions are there. Once you got it, you get this field here. So you can see you get control over the uh, offset of the normals, the rotation of the normals. And then I'm just going to start rotating the normal here. Uh, you can see colors are shifting. They're shifting pretty rapidly, so I'm just going to decrease the precision here. And now everything is rotating nice and slow and with a bit more control. And I'm just going to start and try and find different edges. Just change some settings around here. Hopefully I can get rid of some of the black, but the object is pretty well lined in world space. Get rid of the offset a bit. The offset really just adds small values to the vectors. So it's something you want to do at the end. But unfortunately, Mari sorts the interface in a way that it's at the top. There's not too much change here. Might be the wrong side. Yeah. All right. Uh, I'll just go ahead and add an adjustment stack. And I'm going to pick the color lookup node. Dock the adjustment stack here. And I'm adding two new procedural uh, adjustment layers on top. The saturation and desaturate the whole thing. And a brightness lookup just for control later on. And go to my color lookup and just start by setting all your curves to black just by using the preset that you get on the right mouse button. And then start by pulling up individual curves one by one, trying to isolate the different edge areas. Try something on the brightness lookup, see if we can crunch the values a bit, get rid of those gradients. No, it's still not perfect, far from it. Let's go back to tweaking our masks. And yeah, I mean, you can get reasonably good results, but it all depends on the quality of your model underneath. Like I said, this is a gamer's model, and that means not too many polygons, but everything is based around polygon normals. So especially if your smoothing groups are a bit funky, um, you might get quite jaggedy edges. So keep an eye out for that. I'm just going to have a look at a slightly different model. 
so here's this little picture frame that I've been preparing in advance and you can see I've uh, got some oxidation going on on the sides might be hard to see it's sort of the old Justin stack actually I've got two layers here that do different things but they're based around the same setup and if we just look at what the surface normal is doing here it might be very hard to see on this particular video I'm multiplying a cloud on top of it just to get this kind of dirty feeling to it it's very rough but it's for illustration purposes it'll be enough and the setup is the same I'm just gonna increase the brightness look up here so you can see it a bit better I've got the sides of the ornaments isolated pretty well and you can just evaluate the whole stack and keep changing settings and the dirt and oxidation will update accordingly just crunch it up a bit if I, if I were to rotate the base normal I could probably get it a, sitting a bit more on the edge and not too much on the sides so it's just a bit of tweaking and trial and error but yeah that's pretty much it Hope it gives you a good idea and see you next time.